6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 21. Yeah! How are you? Really? What do you want? Yeah! How are you, kitty? You beautiful kitty. Yes, you love bug. You love bug. Happy New Year, Oven Mitt. Sometimes I sit on this old it's a gate holder that hooks over the gate to hold it open. And just sit here and watch and wait for the sheep to finish eating. Oh, and then I get company. Hello, you. Are you going to come up on my lap? Yeah. 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 You're a good kitty. Inca having a bit of a munch. So, Ovenmit and I watching the sheep eating, having their meal. It's a kind of overcast, meh, cloudy with spots of sunshine. New Year's Day here on the farm. Yes. And I've chosen my word. Every year, in case you haven't read the tweets or my other social media remarks, instead of doing a New Year's resolution, I always choose a word and have for a good number of years. And the word this year I've decided to choose to try and live this year by <laughs> is planting. Now, that could be planting seeds. It could be planting trees. It could be planting ideas. It could be all the other kind of connotations to do with planting. It could be planting new learning within my own mind. There's all different kinds of things it could mean. Look at this. You're watching as well, are you? She's lying down now. Anyway, so my new word for 2023 is planting. I do plant trees. I do plant seeds to grow my vegetables and plant plants for pollinators. And hopefully I plant lots of ideas. How are you beautiful? Oh, I'll admit, you're not sure about this, huh? You're not sure about this. Oh, and a second one. Oh, I'll admit, this is getting overwhelming for him. He's now hiding under my arm. <laughs> too many sheep all at once is too much for I'll admit. Yeah, he's gonna leave in a minute. Oh no, don't chew him. That really is taking the piss a bit too much. Don't chew him. He just doesn't need to be chewed. Okay, beautiful? Yeah, I prevented you from being chewed. I know my mother wouldn't appreciate you being chewed. Oven mitt is my mother's favorite. Well, actually she christened him unintentionally when she was looking for a, an oven mitt to take a roast, kitchen, a roast chicken out of the Aga oven. 
she found her hand was placed on a cat instead of an oven mitt. So that's how oven mitt got his name. <laughs> and another sheep. I'm surrounded by sheep with a cat sitting. Ooh, look. Ooh, more people trying to love oven mitt. I have sheep all around me now. Oh, oven mitt's not liking this. <laughs> oh, I don't blame you. They're rather pushy, aren't they, oven mitt? Yes. Yes. Oh, they're rather pushy. <laughs> okay, oven mitt. I'm going to rescue you. I'll put you up here on the fence post. Come on. <laughs> the funniness of a cat being overwhelmed by sheep. It's not funny for cats. They don't like it, do they? No. <laughs> okay, a little bit. <laughs> okay, 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 Brindle, Brindle. Leave her be. Come on. Come on, girls. Hey! No. Come on. Look at them all going. Heading out. Over to where I put the bale of hay. They're leaving oven, oven mitt. You're safe now. Come on, little bit. <laughs>